St. Joseph and HDDA announced it will redevelop St. Joseph's only downtown hotel. Thanks for joining us. I'm Mary Grace Rice. And I'm David Bowden. The new ownership group of the Red Lion Hotel originally planned to refurbish the hotel, but now they're going in a different direction to completely tear down the existing hotel and build a new one. KQ2's Danielle Soxley has more on the plans. The Red Line Hotel, located right behind the street from me, is the only downtown hotel in St. Joseph. The hotel is no longer active, but the city now has plans to tear it down and rebuild a new one. So the, the cost is kind of a, um, a neutral as far as um, the, the total rehab of that development. However, it's tough to fit a new um, prototype of Marriott into an existing 1980s Sheraton. The brand new hotel will speed up the process, making downtown restaurant owners happy to see more customers sooner. I think it'd be great for St. Joe to have a place for visitors to come, be able to stay downtown, uh, be able to walk around downtown, uh, experience the different shops close to the river, being able to um, really get uh, immersed into downtown and to St. Joe, our architecture, our history, the arts. Maudlin is the owner of popular St. Joseph Spots Felix Street Gourmet and Room 108. He says the brand new hotel won't only help his businesses, but bring in a major increase in customers to all downtown shops. My wife and I, when we travel, we like to stay in uh, downtown areas of the cities we visit. It, visit um, so that you get kind of that local, the to taste of the local community. So I envision a lot of people will really appeal to them to be able to stay in downtown. I think it's a great revi revitalization uh, project and it'll help downtown and bring a lot more people to St. Joe, which will help St. Joe. St. Joseph has been in the process of revitalization in the downtown and riverfront area for years now. Maudlin saying having a new hotel is a dire need to continue the progress. So glad to see it progressing. It's been disappointing to um, not have that space being utilized, and so I'm really excited for this. In just a couple of weeks, the city council will officially vote to completely tear down the Red Lion Hotel and rebuild a brand new Marriott Hotel. Reporting from downtown St. Joseph, Danielle Soxie, KQ2 News.